Hey guys, Yang here. Sorry I've been busy for the past week and I haven't uploaded one of my deck profiles. So I guess I'll give you guys an update on what deck I've been running competitively. And um, I'm pulling out for my deck box as to show you guys what gear I'm using, I guess. So um, yeah, I'm using this uh, very, very cool deck box. So side deck is here. Main deck, extra deck is here with the deck uh, divider and the tray. Yeah, there's a cool dragon blue eyes art there. And then uh, I use the blue eyes dice, obviously, in the dice tray. Been using that for several months now and uh, very happy with that. Anyways, um, I'll be showing you guys my Castira deck that I've been using for two weeks in a row now at my locos. Um, currently 9-1 uh, with this deck, I believe, in two locos. I have yet to break with this deck. This deck is just super consistent. Okay, three Fenrir, no, no introduction needed. As with two, three Unicorn. These are the best cards you can have in your opening hand, obviously. Two Rise. One Ogre and one Scareclaw. Very good cards. Um, Scareclaw is extremely MVP as well. Um, three Hand Traps as in three Ash. And then uh, three Lava Golem. Um, I main deck this. And then the spells, I got three Wraiths off. Terraforming, three Theosis, these are all very standard numbers there, three Birth, Birth might be actually be the second best card in your deck in my, in my opinion, we got Set Rotation and um, uh, Rectophobia, um, so this is Consistency and uh, I don't mind having this in my opening hand if I go second because most of the time there's three defense monsters on the field and you can pop a back row or pop a monster with this. It's It comes up a lot. And then um, three consistency cards, three pots. Some tech cards here. We got two books, two econ. These are all very good as well. Since Econ can dodge a lot of hand traps and very good card utility wise. We got three Imperms and then uh, one Big Bam and one Prep. From nothing is much needed to say there. This is mandatory, one of. And this um, helps you out in the grind game way a lot. It gives you infinite resources basically. There's that for the main deck. Go to the extra three Arise Hearts. I was playing two, but I guess they you go through these really fast and you, one of them could get sniped by your opponent's Diablosis. So you play three and two Shang. One Diablosis. One Noir. I ordered this before the spike. I just thought it's a cool rank seven to have. I don't plan on playing the deck. And uh, one uh, flare metal, two eyeball, two Zeus, one dark arm, and lingeribo and Donner. Okay, and then uh, quickly go to the side. We got evenly probably the most broken card in the game. Like it's either main deck lava golem or main deck evenly. So you could change it to this over the lava golem. So that's fine as well. Then I still side the two thrusts because thrust is very flexible to search for these one ofs. The, the actual talents. And then uh, three cross outs and one nib. 
because I am very greedy player, cash tier player, and I like to lock zones and um, cross out insures. You do that safely. And the last one is uh, probably questionable, but I personally really like rivalry. And um, this piss off uh, someone at my locals. It's, uh, <laughs> it's. I mean, what can you say? Like, uh, Trap Tricks is in the meta. This car is good against Branded. Like this, I guess you could be D Barrier, but I personally don't like D Barrier because um, D Barrier stops him for one turn. This stops him forever. So, and uh, you can just um, flip this on your standby phase. You, you won't not you won't get Lava Golem or Sphere Mode. And you can just sit behind your family Unicorn Ogre and Shang. They all do something and they're all huge. So, I every time I activate this, I've never lost a game. Well, personally, I only lost one game to the mirror match because um, I'm still kind of in inexperienced with this deck. So yeah, that's my um, cash tier deck profile. I'll definitely be doing a trap tricks deck because um, I'm still waiting on some of the higher rarity cards. I'm not doing like common Marmello, common Sarahs. Uh, so um, anyways, um, that's it for my cash tier deck. I'll probably be uploading a trap tricks that this, this weekend, no later than this weekend. So um, stay tuned for that. Anyways, hope you guys like my deck and um, please uh, leave a comment down below and like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in a few days. Bye bye.